doing a Broadway show is three hours of a marathon versus shooting a television series is 16 hours of like sprint, stop, walk, sprint, stop, walk. Um, so it was, it was a great test of endurance in a different way to, to have the same level of energy at 6 PM that you need to have at 1 PM. Um, so sorry, 1 AM. So that was a really fun challenge. Thanks for taking the time today. This show is awesome. It's so much fun. Uh, my first question is for Jason and Madison, which is your characters are kind of the worst, especially in the beginning. Uh, That's fair. <laughs> but but we get into why. So was it was it how long did it take for you to find sympathy for these people? Honestly, I don't think it took me very long. I think that was like kind of kind of the job of of when you're playing a character who's a little bit more difficult like that is like right away, okay, how do I connect to them in a way that I can like be on their side in a certain way so I can play it as believably and as three-dimensionally as possible. Absolutely. Um, I had a conversation with our showrunner, Annabelle, at the beginning of the season about who Susan was in the long run. Um, and a lot of the things that I was working on when developing the character was making sure she wasn't a Regina George. I think on paper, she looks like a blonde mean girl, but there's a lot more to Susan when you start to peel back those layers this season. Um, and so I wanted to make sure that everything that was coming out of her mouth at the end of the season, once you've learned everything, you can go back and everything's justified. And maybe not as mean as you thought it was um and so it all comes with like a uh an intention of truth for her so now i know you've done i think you did book of mormon on broadway i know you've done like theater how was it difficult for you to transition like your theater acting style into being in front of camera and tv i thought it would be but hazel is so reserved that it honestly made the transition quite smooth because Hazel is someone who's not trying to draw attention to herself. So my choices had to be small. And she's such an observer that like, it's the slightest glance. Like she has all of these tiny little isms that like, makes such a ruckus, you know, like they cause a wave and she, she's kind of unaware of her own power. Like there's like an eye roll, like not to spoil anything, but she does like an eye roll that like starts a conversation. And so like, I didn't have to do it very big for that thing to happen. Mm -hmm. Um, so I, I'm, I'm grateful to Hazel for making that tra transition super smooth, but it was still a big transition in terms of like run, uh, doing a Broadway show is three hours of a marathon versus shooting a television series is 16 hours of like sprint, stop, walk, sprint, stop, walk. Um, so it was, it was a great test of endurance in a different way to, to have the same level of energy at 6 PM that you need to have at 1 PM. Um, so sorry, 1 AM. So that was a really fun challenge. <laughs> I want to know what are each of your favorite songs from the original Grease movie? My favorite song is hopelessly devoted uh it's just such a beautiful ballad and it's so simple and pure and um i'm obviously a huge fan of the late great olivia newton john um and so i'm she was just such a a beauty and a powerhouse and an incredible person and and i think that really shines through her performance um both emotionally on screen and vocally mm -hmm. <laughs> I love I think just Summer Lovin', just a yeah. classic. It's just a bop. It's so fun. I love how they filmed it. Good voices in it too. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I was also gonna say um they're uh hopelessly devoted, but a second a close second is there are worse things I could do. It's just mm -hmm. like I just want to stroll through that hallway and just sing about everything I feel the way that Rizzo does. I I really love that song. That's awesome. I think that's uh all I have for you today. But congratulations on this. It's so good. Can't wait to keep watching. Hey, thank you so, so much. Great.